Hey guys, it's Crystal Flames, and I'm going to show you this new model I just invented. I call it the easy, not so easy, easy flasher tessellation. I designed it after Jeremy Schaefer's not so easy flasher tessellation that he published in his book Origami Ooh La La. It's a tessellation of 16 easy flashers on a 32 by 32 grid. But, I decided to make a 16 by 16 grid flasher instead. It's not much of a flasher, but you could use it to mesmerize your friends. Okay, so, start with a 16 by 16 grid and fold it so that it's a 14 by 14 grid. So you shorten each of the edges by one, like this. and flip the paper over to the clean side. Locate the center four squares, which for me is right here. And then draw squares around the corner of the outer four square, center squares. So it's like this. And then just continue outwards for every two squares. So one, two. And so on until you have 16 squares in total. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So next, you want to connect the four squares so that there's sixteen easy flashers. To do that, take these two squares right here and then draw a straight line from these two sides and just alternate in between the squares like this. And for the next row, it's the opposite. Oops. And do the same on the other side like this. So that it's spreading out in four directions. Like this.
then you mountain fold on all of these lines that you just drew. After you've done that, then it's time to make the valley creases. So in between each line, each 2x4 rectangle, you want to make a V-shaped valley crease like this. And do that for every single rectangle. For purposes, I'm not going to draw them all because it's not necessary and you already know everything. And for these,
and check to make sure that you've done every single one. Once you're done, then it's time for the collapsing. It's actually pretty simple. Just start at the corners and then work your way inwards. Once you've done all the outsides, go inwards. And once you've done that, just squish all the edges in, and then you're done. And then remember to pinch the undersides to make it more compact. 